The man gets up in the morning, finds a cross drawn on the head, thought it is a prank, but he can't wash it off. He asks his wife about it, but she sees nothing, he's going to be late for work, so has to be out with the cross, cover up along the way. More suspicious, under the inquiry of his colleague, he carefully takes off the handkerchief, but his colleague can't see it either. As time goes by, the imprint of the cross is getting deeper and deeper. His wife just thinks he might be under too much pressure, advise him to go to see a doctor, but even the most sophisticated instruments can't see anything abnormal. The doctor prescribes the medicine indifferently, completely shatter the man's hope. Is it because the man is mentally abnormal, or other people's eyes get problems? He certainly prefers the former, but when he goes to the subway station in a muddle, he accidentally sees a man with a shining cross on his head, immediately can't restrain his excitement. The two meet at a roadside stall for dinner, talking about the cross on the head, only then does the man realize that the other man has been like this for two months. But the understanding of the cross, not as much as the man, only from his father. He can guess something. Before his father died, there was also a cross sign on his forehead. After two days, there was an accident at work. After the man hears this, instantly he's frightened. But the other man is very calm, make his own assumption. <laughs> <laughs> the man is even more frightened, instantly talk incoherent. Today he is watching the news at home, suddenly sees the news of the death of a well-known author, and the author also had a cross on his forehead in the video before his death. The man suddenly remembers the other man's assumption, he calls the other man unexpectedly. His wife says that her husband was dead. So far, the other man's assumption is confirmed. This also means that the man will die soon. He starts moping. Even buys an insurance policy for the family. Since can't escape death, it's nothing to be afraid of. He cheers up every day, leaves the best for the family, also becomes full of enthusiasm at work. Until today, he is in the tram after gets off work. But he finds that everyone on the tram has cross marks on their foreheads. He is terrified, immediately realizes that the tram is going to be in danger. No one responds, he has to get out of the tram by himself. But all the people in the station have the cross on their heads too, even if he runs to the street, there are still cross everywhere. Suddenly he realizes something, immediately rush home. <laughs> But when his wife and daughter turn around, he falls into despair right away. It turns out that the whole country are infected with Ebola virus. All the people can't escape the death this time. 